all right ladies and gentlemen thank you for clicking welcome to my channel if you are new here hello welcome my name is lillian and today is my very first time making a trip to sunyani as a matter of fact this is definitely the most difficult trip i have ever made as a content creator traveling around ghana since i started traveling to create content guys last year i made an attempt to visit sunyani but i couldn't get anyone over there or i couldn't get someone that knows someone that could hook me up with someone over there so i could visit you know someone to help organize hotel show me around just basically tell me oh this is the bus stop that you should come down at or this is the hotel that you should book at I couldn't find i made a post on my community tab so a lot of people um suggested oh i meet a popular youtuber that stays there but sometimes things don't go like that you get it i wouldn't be bothering a content creator who does something entirely different from my niche who is busy with her life you know i wouldn't be going to her to say okay oh go look for a hotel for me you know so i knew it wasn't time for me to visit Sunyani, so i let it go this year i made a video earlier talking about the stress of being an adult you know how difficult life is as an adult living in africa with children so and i think the sweetest people on that comment section were telling me to move to Sunyani. the life over there is a lot easier and everything in Sunyani is moderate education accommodation transportation you know basically cost of living in Sunyani is a lot easier i mean a lot cheaper than you find anywhere else in ghana right now yeah I'm an adult i'm adulting responsibly so i'm looking for every opportunity that can help me you know so i decided to make this trip i know nobody over there all the people i know could help me do not know anybody in sunyani that is very strange you know so i packed my bags and i hit the road no idea where zero idea where i was going to so, but no i'm going somewhere called sunyani so already i'm here so let's tour the whole place i went house hunting in this video i went to school hunting in this video i went to the airport in this video i went to the market in this video but this video is not going to be me giving my thoughts i'm just taking you guys through some of the places that i visited while in sunyani so let's do this i was told that there's an airport that is functioning right now in sunyani a lot of people do not know that the airport is back again and running smoothly so i said okay let's go to the airport and take a look but you know that airports are the most difficult places to film in Africa. You know, people don't like the idea of seeing cameras, you know, in Africa. So that is quite understanding. But the guys I met there were incredible. They were nice. So I, I told them, oh, the videos are not meant for dangerous people. I'm just using them for my YouTube channel and it's not going to bring any negativity to the management or the airport itself so they they, are, they believed me so i couldn't do much over there i turned back and then let's drive around town because i do not know where to go i was just going about just roaming the streets like that so room with me in this video do not forget to like this video do not forget to comment and maybe in another video i'll give my thoughts about the cost of living in sunyani practically like i've done this so i've heard it's the cleanest town in um in ghana yeah in this video i'm not here for that okay i won't even be going there i just want to focus on the cost of living but that 
I think maybe in another video. So stay tuned. Let's explore Sunyani. And I will see you in my next one. Bye. So guys i changed my mind i just realized that as a content creator it is about adding value to your audience and that is why i changed my mind so let's talk about almost everything in this video ranking from cost of living like uh, apartment to rent an apartment and also to get a school for those who have children just like me and then those that are looking for what again yeah these things um accommodation education and what again okay just other cost of things like maybe food or just a few of them that i you know did that i wanted to you know i research here so those are the areas we're going to hit on so in case you are also out there you're wondering you're thinking you've heard a lot about sunyani just like i have heard and you're seeking answers you wish so this video is definitely going to be of help so let me start with school so i went school hunting yeah i was taken to uh, about two different schools i wanted to do like a school you know that is um all right so i i went to two schools and then the prices are okay you know according to the schools so which is perfect okay i went to that and then um i don't know if you want to know how much exactly which i wouldn't be able to do because the school the schools that i visited i have to protect their own um privacy so in case you want to know deeper than that i think you should visit but ranking from let me put it like this from okay let's say to get your child into school between three thousand cities to a thousand cities will get your child into school which is fair you can see the other school i went to a thousand cities and the other one i went to three thousand cities so the choice is yours they all have their you know if i want to read i'll tell you okay oh this is as a parent this is what i noticed about the school and this is what i noticed about the school so the choice is yours so for accommodation you can get a house here for as much as okay let me go back to the school aspect that money is i mentioned is not for um yo it's not for the subsequent school fees okay i'm talking about getting your child into the school that's admission like uniforms books feeding and uh, the bus right if for those that do not have a car you know a bus that will take your child to school that's what i mean and then the other one as well including books uniforms and a bus ride to the school and school fees and feeding for a thousand cities do you understand so let's move to the other part which is accommodation so you can get an apartment here from if you want like a solid two bedroom solid like perfect finishing you 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 should keep like 800 cities and above per month and some people tells you to pay for two years i went into a couple of them the ones that i saw you can get some in this same sunyani you can get apartments for 600 cities for two bedroom apartments do you understand but you should be ready to keep like 800 if you want you know just keep that in case and you can get like a one room self contain for 200 cities it also depends on the location right and then you can get one and one room and palo for 400 cities yeah if you go online you see cheaper than that but in reality it is not so <laughs> don't be confused i thought so but i like practical i like to i like to know something rather than just assume it so that is why i came so the apartments you can get within that range now let's talk about food like food is one thing that i think i noticed is visibly cheaper 
in Sunyani than where I live. So we bought um, a crate of egg for 46 cities, which that same crate of egg you buy in Accra for 54, 55 cities, that size that I bought. Unfortunate, I couldn't show you guys in the video. Uh, we bought plantain for 10 cities. That right now in Accra, I think there's a bit of I don't know if plantain is scarce at the moment. It's scarce, right? I you can't get that particular one that we bought for that amount in Accra right now for 10 cities. But when plantains are everywhere, you can get okay what again did i oh bottle of alcohol all right let's do this it's very important to some people you see a bottle of club here in this town like we went to prisons they have a restaurant at prisons we went there a bottle of club is sold for eight cities instead of 10 cities in other places around suyani here in accra i do not know the price because i hardly drink so and a bottle of guinness is sold for eight cities some part of sunyani while in other parts you can get from from 10 depends on where you went to so what again am i going to say a bag of sachet water is sold for yeah then uh, nine cities that's the same amount i buy here that's if you want to buy the one the popular ones like let me give them free advert votic if you want to buy like votic is nine cities but they have some for seven cities when that comes to mind you already know what comes to mind like when you hear that different in price is something just know that there is always a reason for that so the choice is yours what again did I try to get in this place? All right. Another thing I tried to know was what again? I think that is all. So, okay. Oh my goodness. I bought watermelon, right? And that watermelon I got for 30 cities. That in Accra, you can't get for 30 cities, definitely. I bought avocado pear for 10 cities, which they gave me a lot of it for 10 cities. In Accra, you can buy one of it for 10 cities. So yeah, I can see that food is visibly very affordable over there. As if they plant a lot of watermelon. I'm yet to get to that part. But meanwhile, my throat is dry. Zurück nach Haus, ja. Yeah. Lass uns den Schritt nach vorne gehen, zusammen in die richtige Richtung drehen. Ich fühle dich sicher von Ost nach West. Komm, halt dich an mir fest. Schau dich in Ruhe um, du musst nicht rennen Lass uns den Schritt nach vorne gehen Zusammen in die richtige Richtung drehen Ich fühle dich sicher von Ost nach West Komm, halt dich an mir fest
Von Ost nach 